Hey yo together and very welcome back to this Darkloft 2 Unranked. The last game was not really good. Um, but we learned that we need supply depots at specific positions to be able to spot Nidus Worm. Also, check for the third base. It could have been three base, uh, two base Mutal as, as well. I didn't scout it, so not really well played there. Because of that, and have the Viking out at the right time. So yeah, no good. I really don't like this map. It's a four-player map. This map is good, don't get me wrong. But it's a four-player map, and I rather like to know where my opponent's bad. But hey, that's just me. So I tried to stack those bad guys ASAP because it really helps, it really helps a ton. Having them stacked is indeed very helpful. So that's what I try to achieve here with them. Try to stack them. It just boosts your economy a little bit. Not enormous, but it makes a difference. It makes a huge difference later on if you wanna have uh, if you wanna hit timings, it's so important. For a Master League player, I would say it's you have to you have to stack marines and probes and drones. Otherwise you won't be able to hit the timings as crisp as you could. And can make a huge difference. So I gonna try that, stack them so far. They're not unstacking as well, which I really like. Normally they unstack and that's so annoying and then I'm like, ah, oh god, forget about it. But this time, it's looking good. So having this built here, and you go there. Look at the timings. It's it's matching really nicely. Uh, for scouting purposes, I will have the Hellion only. But that's fine. I only need to know where my opponent is. The scan later on will clarify what I'm playing against. Uh, I will have the Watchtower possibly, I hope so, if he's not going for the Hellion Marine Elevator. I should be able to maintain map control as long as possible, as long as I need to, to be able to see if it's Banshee or Drop or not. Uh, it won't be some kind of cheese right there proxy, I guess, because how should he know where I am? Look at the time, look at the money, because of the stacking. Oh, bam, bam. Bam, 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 bam. Oh, a little bit marine, a bit late, but it's okay. And what I'm going to do is throw down a supply depot right there. You can go back now to work. Okay. And I need the refinery. Perfect timing. I hit it. It could be the case that this guy is going for a Reaper and the, uh, the, the SCV is still there. This could happen and it's very strong. But I doubt it. I really do. So you go there. I know that was the stacked marine but simply I don't care. Uh, because if he, if he does that with the marine and the uh, Uh, and the Reaper, he got the, the SCV to tank, which is really helpful, and can possibly just kill one Marine. And this can snowball fairly e easy out of control, so I need to be carefully there with that. have a close eye on my borders. So one more SCV will be produced. I will call down a mule, then I will produce the Raven as soon as I can. There we go. Halt! Stop! Wait, and uh, there we go. I need another supply depot ASAP. Then lift the factory, sting, shing, and just scout around a little bit. Okay, he scans now. This is an okay scan uh, because he sees everything. I could fake cloak now. Okay, doesn't cost me anything, it's just fun for me. Okay, so let's see where he is. There he is. Found it out. Perfect stuff. 
now I know where he is. And it really helps me. And if he if he paid close attention to Did I do Ah there it is, the mistake, of course. I was wondering where my money went, but this explains it all so good. Yeah. But it's okay. Hey, it happens to the best. Not really, but it happens to me. I'm okay with that. Uh, as there will, as there won't be any shenanigans at the front as I got a supply depot wall. I should be fine here. I will need another supply depot, which is so late again. And the medic costs only two supply, which is good. I got 15. Ah, the tank will be late. The tank will be late. To the party should start now. We'll take 10 more seconds, so the drop will be 10 seconds later. It's not good. But I can't change that right now. I just fucked that up. Mm, I will have the Raven right here. And uh, with the Marines, I should be fine. I can have. I need to be so careful because when I played against 4GG, he saw stuff. He saw the Raven, and I saw the Banji. And I did a huge mistake there with not. Uh, I lost the Raven. And I did call down mules instead of saving energy. So he killed me, he killed the raven, I could kill the banshee, didn't see that, had no energy, GG. So annoying. But this may happen if I'm not careful. So there's nothing. I don't see there anything, so I can't drop here. Or oh, wait, I can't drop right there. Right on top of the production. Ah! Oh, ah, oh, that's not good! That's not good! Whoopsie! Oh no! Oh no! Ooh, that was close, man. The problem is I... Okay. Micro, micro, micro. Get the ta- Ah, damn it! Get the turret here. Get the stuff out here. And that, that, wait a second, land it, land it, except that, I guess I traded okay, but it's not, it's, uh, it's not one, right, so I will need to get down some units there, I didn't lose the Raven, but I lost. Where's the medivac? Okay, I need that. So another tank there. Produce supply depots. Okay, and then good. So the drop could hit me hard if I'm not carefully there. So I need to produce stuff right now, it's very important to produce stuff. And repair those units. I have marines in position to deal with anything which could hit me. And maybe get the units back there. Get them. Try to get combat shields as well. So saturate this gas finally. There is one widow mine. I need to catch that. I need to catch that. Because later on this will be so un come on! Where's the video mine? Where's the video mine? Where's the video mine? Oh god! Oh god! So I lose the ah, I didn't lose it. Yes! Good stuff! Really good stuff there. Tank goes down! Bye bye! Come in! Yeah, there you go! He's on the run, so I can attack with that. Get a base, another one. And I can't punish him quite hard, I guess. Uh, I need to produce more supply depots as well. Just to make sure I don't straight up die. And then go there. Have them there. Where are the tanks? I need those. So spread the marines a little bit. 
just a little bit. Perfect. One tank there, one tank there. More stuff. I have the weekend Viking in the back. Mm, go a bit further. Slowly siege. I have the medics in position. There he goes. He got stim. So he will be able to trade fairly good here. But is it enough? Yes it is. As it looks like. So I need to try to rescue those. He traded very good there. So let's have another drop. And double upgrades. Upgrades. And this one is going to producing this. Okay. So the double drop could deal damage. Oh, now I lost. That's not good. So I got still myself. And can be very annoying right here. In his main base. I just need to make sure that I don't die to whatever is coming right here. He's playing this really well. He is really well playing there. It's, it's not looking too good for me to be honest. But I can still win this I guess. Uh, this drop was a bit annoying. I need to make sure that I don't die to any drops. I will have marines sprinkled everywhere. Could need a second factory. And combat shields I totally forgot those. That's not good. I guess I have enough medivacs now so can stop producing them. But I feel like I need more barracks. And I also could need some turrets here as well. Just in case. What's there? His army. Oh yeah. Uh, everything being produced now at that location. As I got enough stuff here. I can't. Sadly, I can't expand right now that's the problem but should be fine okay so there he is with his stuff now if he tries to drop that won't gonna that this won't happen yeah he got so much stuff there So I can pressure this tank, which is good. Back, 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 back! A little bit annoying. Try to trade as good as I can. I am I supply block? No, not quite yet, but soon I will be. So, plus one, plus one is ready. So now he's getting Vikings. And this is indeed annoying. Uh, yeah, this is indeed annoying. So all I could try is go for a double drop again. Right there, outside the space. And try to get it like that. So that's gonna work for me. He's pulling back, so now I can go there. And set up a flank or anything like that. I also can get this one, I just need to make sure I don't die to his army. It's just right there. And there we go. Big engagement. Tanks are doing good for me so far. Is it enough? We will see soon. Yes, looks good. Looks good. Got it. He 
Looks good. I got it. And I got a lot of SVs, which I should transfer instantly. And go up here. And there. Those guys should go here. What's what's wrong? Okay, I have no clue. But it's looking okay. I could need more upgrades. Stuff, 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 stuff. And... Go this way. I also should take one little guy, one marine. Yeah. And scout for any hidden bases. So there he is. Okay. I see that. Ah, uh, no way for him to win this game, I guess. So he will lose this base for sure. No way to hold this. Ah, uh, tanks would be nice to have. Yeah, bye bye planetary. Stim to win, get 3-3 three, three upgrades. And go back for another angle. 3-3 three, three, I said, there we go, and okay, there we go, okay, there's the, ooh, 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 ooh. need to be very careful there. There we go, big attack, the tank's not really in a good position here, so I will need, oh god, this is not looking too bad actually it's a, it's quite okay what I really need is more stuff somehow I'm missing income and I totally know why so but I killed two bases straight here we go big engagement again but this time I will win this oh yeah bye bye and should, should looking okay So let's let's just make sure that I don't die to anything stupid. Uh, I need more marines, just fine. There he goes. Okay. Yeah, I should be fine. He got three three as well. There's a base. Very aggressively, to be honest. So he won't be able to snipe this base, I guess. He will be able to snipe this base. Really well done. So... Huh. But I'm going to pounce again as well. So he will... Yeah, that's, that's what I thought. He will attack right there. There he goes. Stim to win. At least he tries. He will get this space again. He's trading really good here. So... Hmm. That's really annoying, to be honest. Really annoying. Because I have no clue how, how this game will end. It's looking so grim. I will land this base near there to provide anything okay get this base please I don't get it can we win this now just stay here defensively while one part of my army is attacking and the other one is staying here. So I cut him in two pieces and I win. Bam! I am not good at clapping my hands, as you see. That was a really intense TVT and I loved it. GG, well played. That was a really good TVT there. Yeah, Master League, low Master League. He's new to Master, but he played very good. 
I would like to watch the replay. How many games does this guy have? Just 880. So probably uh, Smurf from NA or Korea. Watch replay. That I, I'm gonna watch this replay now because there were, there are some very interesting parts I wanna see. I'm really trying to get better in this game. And as you can see, I'm not playing too bad. It's okay. But Astra is really putting a good fight on this. Mmm. Mmm. Delicious water. So, what do we have right here? So with the drop, that's the first first thing I want to know is, did I deal real damage with the drop or not? And then the other stuff, because he was going full bio. No tanks at all, and this can work, but it's this position, I don't know why he let me get this position right here. In the end of the game, he could have still to reach this, uh, but sniping those, those planetaries and those command centers was really nice. So he doesn't see this at all. The drop will hit at an okay time. That was bad, but he didn't focus down the medevac. And uh, so we see nothing lost in the entire game. This is perfect to see how much damage this can deal. That was indeed bad. I tried to split it away, but didn't work well. He loses the tank, uh, but he got a lot of marines. There are the, the... Yeah, and I tried to pick up the tank. So the SCV is really good with the surround. The turret's helping, but... Not in prime position, they should be in front of the tanks, of course. But now he's trading against those turrets, and I don't know why, because those turrets, the position of those turrets, they, they don't contest anything. You don't need to trade with them, just let them fade out and you're fine. But he decided to lose 13 SEVs, 1 tank and 10 marines against my drop. And overall, I was doing better. And if you look at this, now we are equal. Uh, so I needed to deal this damage to be equal with him. That's why I'm doing this drop. You can potentially kill your opponent, but not if you drop like that. I would have needed the turrets in position, maybe right here. It would be nice if I can drop right here and have the turrets blocking off here. So he has to go all the way around. And then you have the tanks unseached and the marines unseached. Do some cool micro medivac micro. And you can straight up win. With the Atasia did this once on Merry Go Round. I saw that and I copied it because it's so strong. But yeah, let's see. He's going up to uh, five barracks. And one thing why I lost is I forgot the combat shields. God, I am such a noob. Forgot the combat shields for so long. And it really blows you completely. So here, this was unfortunately for me. I was, I only saw the mine. I was like, hey, it's just a mine, right? But okay, I got it. Got the mine. I got also the Viking and very good shots of the tanks. He will lose his tank. And his stim is soon ready. But I can shoot him away. Income wise, uh, 50 against 46. So he's producing more consistently SVs. Or he got a third command center, yeah. But it's nice, it's okay. Army supply wise, I'm 50 against 33. And he got Stim Bio, which is really helping, which is really helping. So, what we see here is tanks are on a good position, but he got a good flank. And most of the marines are behind the tanks, so they don't buffer. He can easily click them and snipe them like here, uh, so they don't deal as much damage. And he just wins the straight. Even though... I did okay with the overall losses as he lost more SCVs. Really good for me. 27 to 1, but. Little like the tank count is very important, which is equal, but I forgot the combat shields. And he is on plus 2 attack going already, and I'm not. I haven't even started 1 1. I'm so bad at this game. I'm so bad at this game. But okay, let's watch furthermore. Losing the Raven really sucks, to be honest. But okay, there's a drop. Uh, a bit annoying, but... Didn't lose much more there. Can trade easily with that. I'm supply blocking him a little bit. It's annoying, but... Overall... Nah. Really nice. I love this Widow Mine, by the way. And there we have... Look at that. Third base, ready and set up. Fourth base on the way. And I'm still on two bases. 
Normally this shouldn't happen, but I felt so unsafe. And here's the reason why. Army supply equal, he's on the way, I have no map vision, no map control, I don't know where he's gonna attack. I'm behind in upgrades, I'm slightly equal, slightly ahead with worker, but tank 3 to 1, but 21 to 27 marines. He got the upgrades, like 1-1 one, one against CSU, soon 2-1 against CSU, not good. I would have loved if he would have tried to drop right here, bam, it died, but that didn't happen. And now he scans, and this Viking is so annoying. Normally in TBT, Marine Tank versus Marine Tank, you don't get the Viking. But this one Viking really is very strong, because it damaged the Medivacs. Uh, you don't have air control if you if your medivacs get shot the, the whole time and you can't attack the viking because the viking is in range of the tank but this guy hasn't gotten too, too many tanks he's sticking to bio i guess his upgrades and uh, my missing upgrades did the job for him those vikings i don't like it going too heavily on viking three is okay one would be really nice three is okay but ah. He wants to con he wants to not contest how is it called to to block me to push me in what's the word called blockade no that's not the word I'm searching for something with con it's it's called with con but not contest or conquest no it's I have no clue. I not surround. There's a drop, which helped me pulling back his army. Six medivacs for all this bio. Mm, okay. So he wasn't able to fix all the command, sadly. But I got one one against two two. And the spread is really good, could be better, but eventually we'll clean the, most of the tanks, reinforcements rescue me there. So I need to evacuate this base, this base is running currently, which is fine. I still don't know the word I'm searching for. If you know it, and if I don't find the word I'm searching for, please put it in the, into the comments. It, it makes me crazy to not remember the word I'm searching for. Not blockade, not conquest, not contest, it's something else. I'm really sure it's with con, but maybe I'm wrong. So, 2-2 two, two now against 2-3, which is okay, it's fine. I got the tank, so this really helps with plus one attack. My bases are just so late. I got the gas, I should, I should have just uh, lifted this base and put it there. But he can't attack in this concave, he gives up the planetary, because he has no tanks, he can't set up our own tank front line himself. Which is good. And there he goes, setting up another base. And this is now really smart. Um, getting in there, he got a better concave. The tanks are okay, but half my army is missing, or a part of my army, a big part. But in the end, I'm trading okay again, which is nice. Uh, this marine is a bit random here. So supply-wise and unit lost-wise, it's quite equal. He can't attack right into that, no way. He loses the Vikings. And yeah, scans. And now the problem is normally I should have had two tanks here and maybe four to eight marines. Just to secure the base. And sensor turrets. If you play TVT or TVP or even TVZ, sensor turrets are phenomenal. Get those. They are awesome. They really help. A sensor turret here would have shown me that he wants to go there right now. I mean, I see it with scan and the army and stuff, but still, I can't nah, defend the space. Maybe there would have been a way with the plus two armor upgrade, but didn't get that. And yeah, behind that, setting up another base. There you got another base. He's really good with setting up bases. And there we go. Again. I have to cancel those. I lose the orbital command again. But for at what cost? He's trading a lot of his army for that. And somehow I don't like this because he can't keep up 
with the remaining forces. And the forces also are stuck on 166 supply now because of that. Ah, but I got tanks and I got a lot of them. Seven tanks against zero tanks. I got way more marines. I got the same medivac count and three three against three three. So yeah, that's that's a good thing for me. I'm just ahead here and everything. Don't get the orbital command again, which is so sad. But this time, I don't know. He's look. That that's the that was the thing. I'm not. I didn't understand. He sees. Look at that. Upgrade complete. There he is. There he is. He sees this army right now here at the minimap, and he stays there. Why don't you go for the ramp? Go for the ramp, go for the ramp, faster, you got time, you got time, still, you got time. And he stays there, and stays there, and still stays there, and he's still not moving. And now, now he's in a huge problem because I got the tanks here covering most of the space here at the front where he's clumped up. I got the better concave as you can see, this, this half circle round here, and he's pushing in into that. And now this happens. He's smartly enough pulling back, as he knows he can't attack there. But all I need to do is have some marines back here. I guess, uh, yeah, those are quite enough. 24, roughly. If he wants to drop on top of the tanks, I can stim and kill all the medivacs for a while. And the other part of the marines is attacking right here. And as he got no tanks, he can't keep up with them. He can't defend them. So, that's a GG moment. Really good TVT. So my upgrades were bad. His orbital sniping was phenomenal. I really liked that move. But in the end, it wasn't quite enough. I'm done with that now. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And as always, I wish you a very nice day. Goodbye.